back on his back. <sighs> Tired today, man. Again. And the alarm went off again. Hi, right, Beckham. How you doing, buddy? We gotta turn that alarm off. No, no, no. No, those are poisonous. No. No. Man, child, this is what I'm talking about with you, bro. No, spit it out now. Spit it out. Like, I tell you this every day. Don't do this, and you do this every day. Why? Why, son? Why? No, boy. Yeah, disgust is right. When I'm disgusted that you just did that. Don't do that. Oh, whoa. That's why there's parents and there's kids. Oh, man. Inside. What are you doing, bro? Every day. I mean, it's not the first time you've seen those, those berries there. They're for the birds. I don't think they're poisonous, but they just ain't going to feel too good on your belly if you eat them. <sighs> Come on, Dad. Open the door. Daddy's got a lot of things I got to do. Please open the door. Let's go inside. Can we not make this a thing every day? This OCD thing that you got going here where we have to shut the door, open, shut the door, click, click, tap, tap. Come on, buddy. Well, I'm trying to make a grocery order here. That was school, man. I don't like that the alarm keeps shutting the phone. I can't stand that. I just let the phone keep recording with the alarm going off. Hi, phone. Why do you got to do that? Okay, let's not. Okay, again, you're just looking at me, son. Hey, come here. Have a hug. Come here. Hugs. Come here. What are you doing? Stop getting into things. Man, you can't have a thing out with him, can you? Okay. Let's focus on what we need to do here. I got this. Okay. Okay, let's focus on what we need to do here. Put our shoes in the closet, please. Socks in the dirty clothes, pants in the dirty clothes, everything, let's go. I'll get you an outfit here, okay? You shouldn't have did that with the berries, though, bro. That was real, that's so dangerous. All right, let me get your blue green here. Blue green. Yeah, he's gotta touch every little thing, man, don't he? Comes to do he's like, <laughs> he opens and shuts the door now every day. Has to do like a knock, knock, tap, tap type thing. Wow. All right, my man. <coughs> Blue green. You like that getting that off your head, huh? Big head. You do have a large head. I got one too. It's okay. All right, let's get him a six right here. You got it? Good job. There you go. All right. Go do your TV thing. I'm trying to get this grocery order going. What is the problem? What? What? What do you need? Now, sorry. Okay. I don't care. You're up there throwing a fit and throwing things. You have a TV here. I'm in the middle of making a grocery order. I'm not going upstairs. No, it's just calm down. Do you want to eat something? Alrighty, immediately. This kid. Upstairs, let's go. I'm literally in the middle of doing something and you can't just let me do it. You're up here screaming, rambling to yourself and throwing things. Let's go. Keep going. Keep going. What are we doing? Bye. I'm trying so hard to be patient and keep my cool. But with a heart condition and him, the way he behaves lately, it's just insane. My heart's already racing again. It's just literally it's from this nonsense. What? The remote. Look more. We go through this every day. I don't know what to tell you. Pick up things. Look behind the trampoline. Look under it. Right? It's probably under the trampoline. Yes, pick up the blue. Blue, big blue thing. Pick it up. Is it under there? Is it on the windowsill? No, I don't know. Back, like, is it really that important to come up here and put this on? Get the, get the two cups. There it is. Look, under the piano. Get the two cups of water. Cups. Get the two cups now, since so you just made me come up here for this nonsense. Every day to stay in remote. I'm so happy with this. Give me the cup. Stop throwing things. There you go. You got it? I love you. Take care of what you need to do, but please stop throwing things and screaming. <laughs> How are we doing over here? How's the building going? This looks really good. You're doing really good with that. Can I get a high five? Good job. Until I get this grocery order finished, this is what we have. This is what I was trying to explain to you. It's like we don't have much, okay? It's not hot. I don't think he likes it when it's really hot or burnt. That was the problem yesterday. Where are we at here? 167. All right. Hungry today. Number three of these. And that's the last one. That's over 150 cars, brother. Good boys. Get rewarded. Cookies. 
Good job. I wouldn't try to poke them through there, buddy. They're cold. No, no, no. Don't do it. He's going to break up. Just eat them. All right, we're going to give you insulin right now. Here, you're going to need like 14 or 15 now with all these mega stuffed Oreos. Yeah, we're going to go with 15 here because that's 200 carbs plus all that sugar. Oh, my goodness. This kid is going to be spiking. This way, he'll be full. I need three of those bagels and that four of those. Jesus, kid. That's, that's more. I can't even like look at that without getting sick. It's so much food. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Make sure that's in there. Good job, you did it. Brave man, enjoy the cookies. What do we say? Thank you. We say thank you? Eh, we're too busy stuffing our face. <laughs> Take your vitamins, kids. We're gonna give you 15, I forgot about these too. You don't have to eat these now. Eat your cookie first. It's fine. Whatever you want to do. Just please don't get sick. Brody, the usual one you get here so your brother doesn't eat them. Brody, boy, don't think I forgot about you. We'll put these right here in the pantry for when you get back so your brother doesn't try to eat them right now. What you doing there? You building? <laughs> Good job, builder. I wouldn't do that with the cookie, though. That'd make a big mess, man. And how about those always? Remember when we were kids, they didn't have them like that, man. That, that's all the good stuff in there, too. That'll get you, get you blood sugar raised. Oh, they're here early today. Ooh. Come on, Brody. All right, you did it right away. Good job. Thank you. Come on, inside. Come on. Come on, inside. Come on. How you doing, my man? How you doing? <laughs> can you get that package for me? Can you pick up this package? Hey, can you get this? Can you pick that up for me? Thank you. Our little helper. Let's go inside. Good job. Sit it on the counter lightly. I'll wait to give him his starburst so he's gotta eat some first. I don't know what this is. This is for me. Oh, this is for the neighbor. This isn't even for us. It's the wrong address. We'll have to go give that to him. Oh, thank you, sir. How was school, Brody? How was school, my man? How was it? Hold on. Let me go run this over to the neighbor's house here. Yeah, this is for. This is for their house over here. All right, we did that. He's got to be stuffed, so I know he ain't messing with anything. He's taking his big jumps. All right, Brody, what do you want? You want some pretzels and spaghetti? The usual. All right, let's do that. All right, Dad's going to get himself one of these. How you doing there? You want more uh, pretzels there? We got to get you some water here, too. Water. What are we up to? We're doing our usual creeping by the door to look up in the window up here. Back and forth, back and forth. Right, come on, I need you away from the door. No. Yes, please. Or, or tomorrow you're not going to get any more Oreo cookies. Do you want Oreo cookies tomorrow? You get off the door. Again, you're not listening to me, son. You're not listening to me, and I said to stop. Go out there to the living room. I'm going to give your brother your tablet. Knock it off. Take your vitamins, kids. Again, Brody boy. These are, now, Beckham already had three bagels and butter, full ones, and four Oreo cookies and gummy vitamins. These are Brody's. I'm going to make sure you eat them because we don't want Beckham to take them. Let's get Brody some water here. May I see one of those to fill up? Thank you. I'm going to tell you right now, don't make this a thing. You need to get off the table. Off. This is now. The whole table as you get bigger will eventually collapse, okay? Or you're going to get hurt. Please don't climb on the table. I know you're getting the perspective of looking at your art, but please don't. Cleaning this out. Uh, he ate all his lunch today. There's some extra pretzels that were in there, so that's good. Good job, Brody. I see you pooped this morning. I saw it in your the pull up in the trash over there. All right, there's your lunch for tomorrow, Brody boy. Let's see, we're running out of everything. It'll be tomorrow. I did the order for tomorrow. So there's more stuff I gotta add. What are we doing? Why are we pushing him? Brody, go ahead, Brody, sit down. Sit down, Brody. Sit. Sit, Brody. Please, hey. Let's hope this will work on there. I should if I wrap it all the way around. Where are we going? 
Fruit snacks. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, he's gonna see the Starburst. No, 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 no. I don't want you to eat them yet. No, 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 no. I'll get them for you. Cause I, then he's not gonna eat anything but the damn candy. Jacob oh, Beckham sits still. He doesn't want to stay still. He's going to the bathroom, standing on the toilet, standing on the kitchen couch. Okay. Look, I get it. Your art. Okay. This is beautiful. Good job. Okay. Can we get out of the bathroom now? If we're not going potty, I don't want you to fall and get hurt. Okay. Thank you. Please go out there in the living room and take a piece of the time. I don't know. Please. I don't want you to fall. Yeah. I know. I'm getting it. All right. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. We'll save the Starburst for upstairs. Like, cause if he doesn't, if he eats them right now, he won't touch anything else. You still aren't full, huh? Pretzel necklace there, huh? Got berries on your arm here. Oh no, that's from school. Like little smiley faces and stuff. Okay, just making sure. There we go, Brody boy. Fanciest lunch ever with the black electrical tape. You can play with that afterwards. All right, we got all this out here now. Recycle kids. He was doing his. And here comes my big boy here. Let's go. Let's get you in a nice fresh pull up here. Get you on the potty. I got it. I got it. Daddy will take care of Brody. Brody, I need you over here, Brody. You wanted this done. As you step on the baby's head, God forbid they ain't a real baby laying on the couch. Okay. Ah, ah. Ah, my fibula is banging to you. Can you please just sit down? No shoes on the couch. Thank you, Beckham, for the help. I appreciate it. Please. Thank you. You're going to make him fall. Brody, can you please lay down, Brody? Okay, this is not how we do this. Okay, look, 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 stop. Get the shoes, get the shoes off of there. Lay down flat on her back like you've been doing this for almost 10 years, Brody. Lay down on your back, Brody. Lay down on your back, man. Thank you, Beckham, but I can do this. Beckham, I got this back. Good job, Brody. Use the potty. I'm going to do some laundry while you're on the potty. And again, you take this and you rip it apart and do the same thing every day. It's the same ridiculous routine. I swear to God, every day. The kids do the same things that they know they're not supposed to do. You just knock the nail out on the floor, Brody. Thank you. You better hope you don't step on a nail. We'll hang it on the one really high up here. Again, that was no, Brody. Every day, no. So we go through more nonsense. This one ran into the bathroom, did the same thing, climbed up on the counter, out the window, gonna fall and hurt himself. Okay, where are we going now? Where are we going? We're not going over to the bathroom again. Okay. <laughs> I just brought yours over there. We got this for Brody Boy. And you can have some too. I know you come running over here. I'm like, bro, you already had four Oreo cookies though. All right, we're going to give you four each of these and that's it for now. Okay? All right. Deal. I'm going to open them all up for you. All right, we got them all open. Oh, I was trying to get the light on there. Look, we got our favorite reds. Our favorite reds. Red, red. Red, red. Favorite reds. Which stack do you want? They're identical. Okay, you can have one stack. What do we say? You're welcome, son. Enjoy. I hope this doesn't put you over. 15 should be more than enough for him, no. There you go, Brody boy. What happened to your finger here? Is your cut? And that's it for now, okay? Maybe later when we play race cars, but that's it. These are going away. Okay, you're welcome. He's going to build with him. You know he's going to snag him. We better eat him. He's looking at him right now. He's, he's already plotting his way of snagging him like you take his stuff. So I wouldn't be surprised. Beck, you got to eat him, Beck. Beck, eat. Thank you. All right, we're going to do a little laundry here. What? If you got to go potty, use the potty. Don't stand on the kitchen counter or on the, on the counter or anything or stop turning the lights on. He's turning the lights on and running away. It's driving me crazy. Yeah, sit. There you go, sitting down on the potty. All right, we're doing laundry here. Good job. All right, let's go through your bags here. Birdie obviously ate all his lunch. Already did that. Good job. I had to tell him mine and wash his hands again. She doesn't listen about that. We'll get there. Thank God the school's working on that with him. I don't have one, bro. Just use your outfit. It's hot out. Yeah, you'll be all right. Just literally threw it in the, in the laundry. Brody had a good day, buddy. Good job. What'd you do? You got some more art here? Oh, Brody boy. Happy birthday, Miss Olivia. Well done, Brody Brown. Brody boy, is you? Brody, you made it. You're not going in there and getting more candy again. You're another one, bro. Like, no. 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 No more candy. No more fruit snacks. No. 
finish your spaghetti. Finish this, and then you can have that. I hate how I have to lock every door behind me while I'm doing anything, including the bathroom, the front door, this door, that door. I can't leave a thing open. I gotta come back in here and flush your poop. There's a toilet still not flushing, but I leave the thing in the back. I gotta turn it off. Handle. Okay, that solves that. Okay, we're not hanging it up on the wall, though. I know it's beautiful. I would love to. But remember, we stopped doing that because you were ripping them up and thought it was fun. No, thank you. See all the issues you're causing me in the bathroom with just the one thing? You think I want to hang something up on the wall so I can deal with that today? Absolutely not. We'll leave this for mom to see. She likes to look at your art. <laughs> just breathe that. <laughs> I, like, I feel fine today. Thank God I got a good night's sleep. Eight meals. Didn't go to the garage or anything, you know, to me time to do too much. Took all my vitamins when I take them today again, too. Oh, good job, Beckham. I'm sure the poor guy gets at the bottom. And you can always pause these, son, if you want to watch them. Thursday. Today is Thursday. Oh, we got Wednesday in there a couple of times. She likes Wednesday. Beckham. Beckham. Where's your report at, bro? What do you do with it? You taking it out? You're already smart enough to go, oh, I don't want dad to see my bad report, so I take it and I throw it out in the bus. <laughs> oh, well. It's probably at school. Good job, boys. All right, Beck, we got to do your long-lasting insulin here. Doctor. Come on. Come have a seat. Come on. I know. I know. But can you just have a seat? I want to get this over with. It's 5 o'clock. we got to make sure we keep on it, okay? Okay. Okay, just have a seat. Now that, see that, what he does here is like an act. This is an act. This is him being an actor. You all right? Are you okay? Okay. It's an act. Please stop with the fake cry and the screaming that you were just doing. Stop. Come on. You're brave. You do this every day. Several times a day. What, four, this once a day and other stuff like four or five times a day. Twice at school and twice at home. Usually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And Brody's up there banging his head into the wall because I told him no to more candy. Oh, I can't listen to this any longer. You guys are really tech. Can we get it together and stop acting for the camera here? Okay, are you done? You're going to make a good actor. You're gonna make, see, you're laughing. That's something you're, you're not. You're not upset. You're just acting out for out of whether the camera's on or not. I'll just do this. I think I'm gonna shave my face. I'm gonna drip and sweat all down my face. I need to go. I know you think all oh, this is so funny to stress that out. Yeah, show me your best. Opinion. to the wall of the head okay yeah the chips deuces please don't do that the head thing please spec our birdies both y'all are driving me crazy while the kids are behaving let's clean up the beard much better i need a haircut though man i'm not even gonna touch the hair i'm gonna try to grow it in a little bit back on the builder while i was doing shaving my face though i noticed the spaghetti's all gone i'm pretty sure he took that with him i'm not even gonna get into that i gotta i gotta take my vitamins here Oh, and both cups are missing, and I see water all over you. Give me the cups now. I see you just dripped it, though, from splashing, but luckily you didn't dump on yourself, and they're mostly full. This was now. Why did you take the water cups and the spaghetti, Brody? Come on, man. You know, bro, I'm, I'm literally taking care of myself, and you got to do things you're not supposed to do. You know better than that. Now, you better hope you ate that spaghetti and then throw it all over the place. Okay? This is yes, though. I wanted to get an overhead shot of the city over here. Like, we got the drone in there. Good job, back on This is yes. It's a masterpiece, buddy. Take your vitamins, Dad. I just realized I want to eat something else. I don't want to have an empty stomach completely with the... You sure you don't want no broccoli? Come on, it's yummy. You eat all the greens, Brody. Come on. Beckham, you want some broccoli? No! What did we say? Okay, that's okay. You don't need to have any. 
All right, making some lemonade. Would you like to help? You want to help? Just wants to watch. Let's try that before, don't we? Lemonade. Lemonade. Yes, lemonade. Now we're waiting for the sugar water to boil. Cane sugar. Recycle. New start. All right, it's a boiling now. Let's turn this off. And then all we do is we take this and we dump it in there and we stir it up. And then you got, you know, some lemonade, man. It's better than any crap you're going to get at the store, man, to be honest. You got to make yourself. Fresh squeeze is the way to go, but this is the best I can do. And we're going to let it chill until I drink it tonight or tomorrow, whenever I drink it. I was finally able to pick up a GoPro Hero for 200 bucks flat. You got 128 gigabyte SD card. I got to test it tonight. They'll let it run nonstop and see if it can do what its max is on certain settings for when I record on turnbuckles and whatever else I use it for. Because I've heard overheating issues, unfortunately. Birdie's waiting for me to come in. I was going to do this out here inside, but I'm just going to let this charge first. It probably doesn't need to charge too long, but we'll deal with that later tonight. Birdie, I put two cups of water up here. She can't wait five minutes for me to go come back up. Where's the cup of water, Brody? This is no. Can you go get the water cup from Brody, please, before I leave my mind here? Nobody's down there, so I put that there. Okay. You're not spitting it, but you never know. That's what you used to do. Okay. May I see this, please? This. Thank you. Good job, my little guitar player. Hope you're not dumping water in there. We gotta make the bed here. What? Kidney fail. What? Candy fail. Candy fail. Oh, candy's down the top of the potty. Yeah, put it on for Brody, please. I have candy for you, Brody, up here too. I got Sour Patch Kids, buddy. Since you're being good, I'll hook you up. I thought you were dumping water. That's all I was worried about. All right, we got the bed made. We gotta show yesterday's video. He's already saying potty. Potty, right? Yeah, you do it. Go ahead. I gotta go check on your brother to make sure I locked everything. I'm pretty sure I damn well did. I just double, triple check. But he went down there to look for something. Oh, I know what he's doing. He's on the the, the T A B L E T. Okay, never mind. We're fine. I'm not gonna go down there. I should have just to double check. I know that's what he's doing. He's smart. He knows exactly what he's doing. I thought that was an SD card for a minute. <laughs> it's like, what is that doing there? It's like, if they can't see me, they don't know what I'm doing. Who's under there? <laughs> Smart boy. All right, buddy, this is yes. All right, yesterday's video is up. Brody's up here because Beckham just chased him up the stairs and screamed at him because he had his tablet. All right, Brody, what do you want? You want some candy? Today is the actual, your lucky day, because there actually is candy down here today, son. We have candy. I got Starburst. I got, I got, I got, uh, I got the noses here, but I got, uh, Sour Patch Kids. I got the watermelon flavor. I got the regular kind. Okay, I know. You reach in the gate over there. They give me the damn candy. Okay. Okay. So now we're just going to open up these ones, okay? The watermelon ones. And let's not go crazy with this, because I know he's going to go for this all night. This is all he's going to want to do, like he always does every day. Just run him down the hallway with excitement. Go ahead. Get. And that's it, though, for now, okay? Maybe a little bit more later, but that's it. Again, the water cups. Beckham's laughter says it all. They're gone. Oh, do you want Brody to break? Are you purposely? You, are you kidding me right now? Give me the tablet. No one gets the tablet anymore. Okay. No more tablet. I just watched you purposely try to. No, get off. You're purposely trying to make Brody break your tablet. This is no. I've had it with this, Beckham. This breaks, you don't get another one. So what are you laughing about? You think it's so funny to do this? No. No. Where's the water cups at? No. This is no. I'm literally trying to figure out the advice of how to keep the camera from overheating. And what did you do? You're out here causing trouble. Oh, I just locked the keys in there, didn't I? I know your mom has them. Hockey. Hockey, yeah. Where's the, where's the water cups? I don't understand. What is going on with y'all? Why is it so, why is it so funny for you to try and break your tablet? Why? I don't understand why that's funny to you because then you don't have one and then you're not laughing anymore. You're purposely making your brother try to break the tablet. You understand how ridiculous that is? 
No, man. What? No, I don't grab onto me. You're just as big. I'm watching you take the water cups and throw them, please. Guys, this isn't funny to me at all. Guys, I'm breaking my balls. They're crazy. Get off the tampers. Get off. Where's the water cups? Get off. Get off. Get the water cups if they're under the trampoline now. Go get me to get over here. Go under there and go get them. Are they under there again? They are. Brody, crawl your little butt up. Now, you crawl under there. You did this. Get up. Let go. No, get under there and go get them. Get the other one. There's one. Go get, no, go get the other cup. Get the other cup under there. Go. Go get the cup. This cup. Go get it. You want to keep throwing them under there? You go get it. Get off the trampoline. You, crawl under here and get it. You think this is a fun joke to me? I'm sick and tired of both of you guys and your behavior. Go under and go get it. It's ridiculous. Don't come near me, but either of you for the rest of the night. I had it with both of you. You don't get your tablet anymore, and you don't get any more drinks, and you don't get any candy. No. You just tried to have your brother purposely smash it. Rebecca, I need the keys when you can. I locked myself out. I need the keys. You're just as guilty, throwing the cups under the damn trampoline and taking them and running off while I'm trying to troubleshoot to find out the settings for this GoPro camera. You guys, don't ever let me do anything I need to do for myself, ever. And the tablet's gone. No one gets the tablet anymore. You don't get it, and he doesn't get it. He was pushing your foot into it, but you kept moving your foot into it on purpose, laughing too. So now. All right, it's like 8 o'clock now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that I saw Beckham pushing Brody's foot down on the tablet, right? Am I, am I losing my mind? So the tablet's gone. I hit it. I'm um, hopefully he doesn't find. It. I just put it under my pants over there. But like, Brody can have it when he goes to bed. Brody's being good. It's just, it Beckham influences his bad behavior, man. I wouldn't be surprised if Beckham threw those cups under there. So I'm sorry, Brody. I don't know, but I, that's usually Brody's behavior too. All right, you ready to do the race cars, my man? But we're not doing any more candy, so don't get that in your mind. And it looks like he definitely dumped water on himself too. That's what sucks. He looks upset because he, he wants to play on that tablet. He knows that I took it away. And his brother was teasing him, whatever, letting him have it, and then pretending like he's stomping on it. It's awful to get you in trouble. He's trying to set you up, man. He's smart like that. Come on, let's do the race cars. Come on, I'm getting it all loaded up here, okay? We're going to do stunt races tonight because for some reason it's not showing what we need it to do. So I don't know, buddy. like when he chills like this it's nice enjoy it while you have it man my buddy my baby boy but i think he's using me for candy i am not giving you candy at 8 30 at night no no and i said no and you're gonna keep telling me to do it and i'm gonna tell you no you had enough candy today it's not good to eat it before bed no you're gonna get your gummies later and that's it tonight I'll give you one or so and i'll give you the tablet yeah so you're tired the sleep deprivation's catching up with you like it was to me yesterday you and I both are bad with our sleep habits, man. No, no, no. I am not giving you any more candy. No, bro. No, man. No. <laughs> Do you remember this car back? Race car boom. He's still asking for that damn tablet. And this one's over here still asking for candy. You guys got You guys got to understand this? No. All right. We'll take second on that one. We just did a nice little cool race. Oh, he was loving it. Yeah, my man. Good job. We haven't done these in a long time. <laughs> I don't want to put the light on because we see some light that he's gonna stop dancing. The music, the racing, really fast like that every time, man. He loves this, man. I love it. Go, Brody, go. Those feet from quick. Yeah, my man. Here, as we finally get a race, we had to do a private one with other people here. It, it's not working today, the hot race. No, no, sit here. Stay here. If he hears you with this, he's going to come running up the stairs. He came up here, grabbed the blanket because he wants to go to bed. These are custom tracks, playlist 12. I have no idea. Never did them before, but we're going to go with it. He's happy now. Let's just hope Beckham doesn't come up and disturb him. Myself. That track was cool, man. Good, good creation. I ended up getting like seventh or eighth or something like that. I was in first and I hit the corner hard. Ugh. Brody, we just can't win a race tonight, man. It's custom playlist kicking my butt, man. We're so close, God. We haven't had one first place tonight, man. 
Good race though. That was fun. He's back in here again doing his thing. He left, came back. Ah, we want first place. Look, Brody, the kitty's floating in the sky. That's the problem with these custom tracks where they put your people at. It's like <laughs> he's just floating up in the air like it's nothing. Like he's Aladdin, man. Yeah, we're we're doing good though. This is good. This is yes. You just gotta stop stimming sounds real loud. You're too loud. It's ten o'clock now. You gotta. Shh. <laughs> I'm not used to tracks like that in here. It was just like bowling balls, like propellers going around. Not gonna beat everybody. It was just like what in the hell? Like there was spots you couldn't even go through things. I'm definitely saving now. It was a hilarious track. That was like some Mario Kart stuff. <laughs> Ah, uh, there's not even a name for it. it just says Hot Rink 2024. Down, uh, downhill Mayhem, like 9 of 24. The bookmark that. <laughs> that. This is an awesome finish. I love this. Look at this. This is how you finish. You just go boom. What did we get? We all hit over. Ah, ninth. There was like nine of us all there. Uh, I've held back. I should have stayed in the front, Brody. That's it, though, buddy. We got to get you to bed, okay? That's it for tonight, my dude. <laughs> that this is an awesome finish. I love this. Look at this. This is how you finish. You just go boom. What did we get? We all hit over ah ninth. There was like nine of us all there. Uh, I've held back. I should have stayed in the front, Brody. That's it though, buddy. We gotta get you to bed, okay? That's it for tonight, my dude. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Come on, let's get you to your room, okay? Come on, this way. Get your blanket, blanket, get your blanket. Okay. <clears throat> I'm not even gonna get into the change of thing. He's got that he's nighttime diaper on. No matter what you do, we're leaky dicky outside a little bit here. It's warm in here. Here. Come on, get you in there. You get to play with it for the night. Go ahead, go. In there. In your little bed area. Or run around wherever you want to go. Okay. We gotta shut these blinds. I'm just glad he's not making me go downstairs, but it's like, yeah, bro. It's eleven fifteen, it's time for bed. I want to watch the news, see what's going on. I didn't watch anything yesterday. I love, I'm not going anywhere else. No, this is it. I love you, sweet dreams. School tomorrow. Okay, we're not doing anything else. Okay, you eat, you're good. Okay, high five. Boom, I love you. I'll see you after school, maybe in the morning. Right. Get some sleep. You're up way too late all the time, my man. This boy, though. Cover yourself up, buddy. It's chilly. You gotta turn all these off. You don't need these on. It's too cold. It's only for the daytime. It's a part. It's the time of year is always a pain in the butt. Yeah, 70 degrees. All right, it'll get to like 74. The builder man. Let's turn this off. The misbehaving boy on there. Turn this off. I love you back. I'm sweet dreams, okay? I'll see you after school tomorrow. Yeah, I know. See you, boy. I love you. Sweet dreams. All right, let's get this out to the curb. All right, this is charged, but I, I don't want to get into this now because I need to. I could take hours depending on what I'm messing with on here. You know what I mean? I don't need to do that. I don't need it right now. Just going back to old unreleased footage that I shot with a GoPro from was it GCW so much fun back in 2020. Never even released any of this. This is all just private experimental, but also it'll be up eventually one day. The quality of the new GoPro, I'm telling you right now, blows this old one out of the water. This was like a little tiny camera, the Hero Session 5, and we're on a 10 now. I mean, it's, you're talking 10 megapixels compared to 20. So. But it looked good. It was good for when you're editing. You don't need to, you know. I know what I need to do now, though. I need to just put a little tiny pole handle on the corner there, mount it up, and raise it up like six inches, eight inches. I just didn't have stuff like that, and now I do. Boom, you see how steady it is? You want that big man hitting there? Ju was it Juicy Patu? But yeah, I shot the whole show on this, man. I believe the whole show. It caught some good stuff. Yeah, three hours and 47 minutes out of the whole show's on here. So one day we'll release it. I mean, you know, you know, again, this stuff ain't going anywhere. It's cool because the entryway is behind there too, and they don't use this this uh, venue anymore. So it's cool to have this stuff. It's like historical stuff, man. Oh, 
And if you raise it up a little bit and, you know, get the extent of fisheye lens a little bit or just wide lens as an ex uh, a pro lens for it, it can capture all that. But I think that's more than enough with it, you know, that you need there. Yeah, it's my opinion. I don't know. I have a lot of shows like this, too. There's like a good 10 or so of ICW, GCW, and I think I did one with H2O. I'm trying to teach myself the ways again, man. Because I, I, I might make ICW Nolan's Bar this Saturday. So I would like to go do that or H2O Sunday and just, you know, put it up there somewhere. I don't care if it gets kicked or knocked down. There's a protective cover thing for it that I got to get. So maybe I'll wait till I get the protective cover out of it. I might... If I do go to the show this weekend, one of the shows, I'm going to put it on a fence somewhere. But again, I got to test it, see its length, and know when to pause it. But there, people are on there saying, as long as you use an external battery. But I want to test, like, is the footage going to be corrupt? Because I don't want to go back and have to deal with all that. So, or I might just use it to do really artsy stuff. You know, I got a lot of ideas. I mean, the stabilization on there, man, it hyper, it's, like, amazing, apparently. So, like, I was watching those examples. I was like, I was like I've always wanted to do stuff like that. But I don't have a lot of stuff that I could do it with, so... Still need a gimbal too for it. They get to be expensive. It all depends on which one you get, but they can get a lot of cool shots. So anyway, I ran one too much because I get excited about this stuff. So <laughs> this shot was pretty cool. Even though, like I said, I just needed it up a little bit higher. And I know how to do that now. I always knew how to do it. I just did not have the equipment. But this still came out pretty cool because his hits first on this side, and then you can see him go down on the other side. I said any company doing you need to have a gopro you need to have a drone you need to have as much possible stuff angles as you can man it's really important boom boom dude that looks sick dude He said, yeah, you ain't knocking me down, dude. <laughs> I love it. Hi, uh, it's like 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and again, I try to be reasonable all the time, but at the same time, be yourself. Not proud of these things. I'm a 42 year old man with two autistic children and I love them dearly. Uh, and again, I'm proud of them today. Um, the more and more I start like listening to others the more, I, I try to like keep to myself. And I, th I would like to think that a lot of y'all do. But we want to help others, but it's like, we're just so overwhelmed with all this shit, man. 
I, I can't take it much more. <laughs> like, uh, today alone was an example. Like, as I document these days, uh, as there was a point where we were monetized when I was recording wrestling, my parents arguing, and then as soon as I brought my kids into this world, it was just like, no, you're not allowed to make that couple hundred dollars a month because they're kids, and you're showing them in the bedroom or, or they're in the bathroom, and, and the simple uh, reply was, no nudity. Obviously, I did it uh, by mistake a couple times. Nothing's there. Now it's just like, okay. You cannot show your kids in their bedroom. You can't show them in the bathroom. I was just like, you can't show the truth of anything that you go through uh, as a parent with autistic kids or anybody with, with, with parents, especially these kids. It's just, it's just wrong, man. And I mean, I, I, I'm thankful that we're able to keep uh, sharing the videos on here, but it's like, why can't we make a little extra money doing this stuff? Nah, it's never going to happen. I, I tried again. <laughs> I've been talking to others, too. As we just need to do, like, a dot .com. We could put the the videos from YouTube on that dot .com and have uh, not just advertisements, but, like, advertisements that, that would help us and benefit us all. I'm sorry, I'm, like, rambling here. I did. The buzz. I got a nice buzz, man. When are we allowed to have a nice buzz? Uh, when I go to these special needs groups, like, no wonder there's, like, like, I'm, like, on five now on Facebook, and it's, like, 75,000 people in one, and another one, this is just in New Jersey, and there's one in the United States, one, it's just, like, it's crazy how many people are, are, are in these, these groups, and how much of a struggle y'all are going through, <laughs> like, I feel for y'all, uh, I really, I just, like, as I, I get choked up, it's, like, I feel for y'all. I was going through it really a lot, and I still go through it a lot. Just trying to figure out something where you can just have time to yourself and where you're not, like, worrying about your kids, uh, you know, hurting themselves or eloping or anything. Like, there was a, a video that popped up on Facebook where a mom had just threw, like, a crib out there. It was like, if you like to sleep in, it's just, like, <laughs> through, like, this whole thing where, like, expanded out, like, you know, and then put the kid in there. It's just like, it, you have to be aware all the time. And it's just like, it's too much. And that's why I, I created the system with the kids with the locks everywhere. And um, I'm very thankful that, that the eloper ban, Beckham was the eloper and he, he's not eloping anymore. Uh, he's realizing what he has available today. But hey, and then what he has available today is like, hey, let me, let me, let me stop on that damn tablet. And let me hand it to my brother and set him up. That's the thing I worry about if I ever get him an official diagnosis. Uh, is he delayed learning or is he autistic? <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> He's got some something going on. The, the, the ODD, oppositional defiance disorder, man. He does not like to, 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 to <laughs> let you set rules in place, man. So this is me being honest. Is I'm... I'm Having a nice buzz going on. I'm having a drink, smoking a cigar. It's chaotic as all fuck. And it's not fair to the parents that go through all this all the time. I'm thankful that I, I figured everything out. Their mom and I, we figured everything out with Brody. But then COVID hit and it was like, you're not allowed to get an official diagnosis for your child of being autistic and all that stuff. You cannot see a neurologist for yeah, centuries. That's what we went through. And I went on the phone the other day, two years, and I tried the next day. And it was like, I was on hold for like 40, 35, 40 minutes. It's like, fuck this, dude. Fuck this, dude. There's literally, as I was told from Perform Care, the, the gentleman came here the one time. I don't know if I document it. I don't know. <laughs> no, I, I know I've talked about it and maybe clips of it and videos of it. He came here and he did not give Beckham an official diagnosis. But that envelope in there speaks volumes. It says everything that he was going that he's going through. He is a tough cookie. He is one of the smartest loving kids you could ever imagine. But man, holy shit today. Again, it's just like screaming yelling every little thing that just doesn't go his way it's just like 
I'm like, buddy, I'm waiting on your brother to go there. What do you want to eat? He's like, oh, I can't get the TV to play the video I want to play, even though I have the 65-inch screen downstairs playing videos that I'm watching right now. I got to go up there and make sure that that's playing and nobody's even watching it. But if brother comes home, he's got to watch it. Also, that's what he goes through in, in his head. He's a brilliant kid. And to say it doesn't drive me fucking crazy is to say I'm lying because it drives me crazy. I was so calm and like content. I was just like, I was so calm, like, yeah, good day. Ooh. Good night of sleep. It didn't come out of the garage. It didn't pour myself a drink. Didn't smoke a cigar. I just had a meal and watched the the the, the, uh, the more modern version of the Twilight Zone. I enjoyed it. And I wanted to do that again today, but after today, I was like, no, fuck this. It's like I need a drink, man. I know it's so awful to say that, but it's like I'm not alone here, man. You all know it's like, damn. We have such love, loving, kind kids. It's just like. It's just really breaking us at times. I don't know if it's breaking you. No, it's breaking me, man. And I'm trying to get, like, things I want to put together. Like, go back to my, my roots. If, uh, or if I didn't have my boys, I love them dearly. But, like, I could have a really full functional career today. As I did it uh, slightly while I was caring for them. But it wasn't my favorite thing to do. I want to go uh, back to wrestling or just capturing, you know, anything I can do with video stuff. I have so much equipment now, like I could literally make a film. To say I'm not broken is an understatement. I am beyond broken. I thought I am so broken at times. But I won't get upset. I am very proud of both of them. I know you guys are proud of your kids too. Because I puff on this damn cigar. It's just tough. It really, is. it really just it gets here at times. I was thankful to to see mom have to work again today, like more in tune. Uh, she's done really well with that. There was a time when it was just like nobody was in tune, just me. Nobody was in tune. And just like you see with them, it's just like uh, I think a lot of us. We grew up. We had our grandparents. We had our parents. We had our everybody, family. It's just not the same today. And it's not their fault, it's just everything in society today. It's just, nobody's going to get by easily today. But I'm truly, like, beat up today. Uh, when I was just trying to get them situation, situated, I'm burning back on where somebody hit me in my defibrillator. This this goddamn stupid thing that I've had since two, 2005, like, several times. Uh, they hit me. Luckily, it didn't, like, shock me. Because does that like <laughs> shock you? Uh, but he hit me and it felt like so awful. I was like, ah, I was like, my whole left side was just like, oh. That's the thing when you have the, these conditions. Uh, and I know I'm doing way better off than a lot of a lot of y'all are with my awful habits and other stuff. And you guys are going through a, a lot, man. Uh, when your health is kicking in and you're you're trying to take care of your kids, it's going to destroy you. It's going to be really hard. I've had moments where I'm so weak at times, and that's my own dumbass fault from not eating a month, eating enough, or uh, sticking away from the, the simple the lemon eat and baka and the cigars. But I feel like more than anything, it's just like getting enough sleep and balancing it out. It's all a mess. I'm a mess. And I know it sucks that I openly admit that, but I'm a mess. I got, uh, as I was saying the other day, it was my father, uh, September 30th was his birthday in 1957 when he was born. So we're, we're like 60 something years old. Uh, nothing. I don't have him around. I don't have my mom around, even though she's still alive. And um, what I want to give to have that situation. And everybody moved away from New Jersey. My sister, everybody, you guys all moved away. And I get that. But I, but I can't just up and move away uh, to the areas you guys live in. Because there's 
there's no good system for special needs kids. And that's why when I look at these, these discussion groups, it's like every state and every school is so bad. Like I'm so thankful that their mom and I, I don't know, it was like a, a sign from God or whatever, whoever it is. We picked Washington from New Jersey is one of the best places to, to raise your special needs kids. They take care of our boys. Like you have no idea. And I'm proud of that. And I'm thankful that, that that's the situation. And I, and I was sleeping in the woods in a van down by the river, as Chris Farley would say. Uh, no matter what her mom, their mom and I go through, I don't care. And I think she's realized that too. It's just like there is no system in place really for the for our kids. And that's why a lot of y'all go through this shit every day. It's just like you're literally like struggling every day. As my legs are like shaking, it, it upsets me and stresses me out to see you and your kid kids go through that every day. It's wrong. They're sending your, your children home. There was a time where we were having that happen. But nothing like what y'all are going to do. They're like not following the laws and the rules. You need to step up and get a lawyer. This is the year 2024, man. We're like 20 years plus into this situation when we actually have that uh, understanding of... of uh, it's autism, okay? And to see you as parents to go through this shit, it really bothers me. And I know a lot of this this doesn't make sense as I'm a fucking mess as I'm sitting out here just puffing a cigar. Having a drink as my kid is up there. He just finished banging his head into the wall. He's done now. And no matter what I do, uh, I could tell him to stop banging us in the wall. I could give him a hug. I could guide him other ways. Was give him the melatonin. The melatonin might make him bang his head in the wall more. Yeah, it, 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 it's never going to balance itself out. What it really comes down to is just being there for them the best you can. And I really hate myself for even like eh, <laughs> discussing this shit, but it's just like it's the truth, man. I am. I'm out here. I'm having a drink at this time. I'm glad I didn't go out here and have one last night. I need to start learning to, to go multiple days without having one. But I'm just overwhelmed all the time. And I have this creative idea to do things and all of a sudden I, I just can't, I can't balance it out. I don't know. When I don't have that support system with a mother, her grandfather and a grandmother that my kids could have in their life, I can't, I can't balance it out. It just, it just fucks me up like badly. Uh, I'm <laughs> thankful that I'm alive today. Uh, but I won't go anywhere. I will always continue to be there for Brody and Beckham. And we we had a good night at the ending of this night. But, uh, again, that's why I want to continue to share these videos. As, again, we don't get monetized. It would be nice to get monetized. Just to have that little simple bit of money. But just like... To, for us to understand each other and understand that this isn't a perfect life. Nobody's going to have a fucking perfect life. You're not going to go through your days like, man, everything was awesome. As Beckham does his rocking, everything is awesome. Like, yeah, cool. But nothing is awesome when your kids are getting sent home from school for self-harm or whatever else they're going to do. And I'm not saying it's my kids, it's your kids, as I've read through these discussion groups. And just, just in our situation, they come back and just like... The, and Brody now, Brody cannot go to, Brody will not go to sleep, <laughs> which is cool with me. Okay, fine. Uh, I did not give him melatonin again, or Beckham. Beckham fell asleep fine without melatonin. Uh, but if I give Brody too much melatonin, he slams his head into the wall like, eh. Like, I don't want him to go through that. And... I don't want to go back to fixing holes in the wall and have to go to the hospital because my my finger got hurt. I had this this finger here. <laughs> this is bad. Look at it. And I never took care of it. Again, I just I I want to speak the truth, and I can't stand that YouTube is not accepting the fact that like. We're an educational channel, and it's like, nah, it's wrong. You're doing this. You can't show your kids in their bedroom. You can't show your kids. Hey, whatever they're doing is wrong. Nah, honestly, you're wrong. It's fine. Don't monetize it. But just allow me to keep sharing this stuff, and then one day they can take over it. And then maybe if Beckham or Brady wants to make it private, fine. 
but how you just skip over a, a whole level of educational stuff for the reason where it's like you don't want to monetize people a little bit. And again, I don't care about the monetization. I care about educating others and us learning from each other and understanding what we're going through. And that's the part that pisses me off. It's like, so my discussion with them was like, so I'm just supposed to say, okay, if my sons were supposed to, if they decide to take over the channel one day, we're just supposed to go back and say, when I went from the wrestling, the videos of my parents, I was like, we're supposed to say, oh, because they were minors at the time. Now we got to delete all that. No, that is part of life. Life is not a beautiful goddamn system. It is, it is sometimes really awful and stressful and struggling all the time. You need to share that with people so they can understand how to improve those, those points of their views in their life and what they went through. And you cannot take that away from people. And it really upsets me and stresses me out that I had to, I had to go through this. I'm just thankful that we're allowed to share it. But I wouldn't be surprised if with time it's like... No, you cannot share this. This is wrong. No, it, it's wrong to not let people see the ups. Like, not only the ups, but the downs of life. And I see it too much on social media. Everybody, like, everybody's filtering their photos, filtering their life, and showing all this fake versions of themselves. Show what you really look like. Show what your kids really go through. Show what you go through with your kids, really. And then you can educate yourself. And if you don't do that, you're going to get lost. You're going to get really left behind. So anyway, okay. My sons, I love you dearly. And as uninteresting and it wasn't that exciting today. It's pretty boring, but I look forward to every day that I'm with you. Whether... It's just myself after school with you guys. And I'm thankful that your mom gets you up in the morning and does all this. She has a good routine with you guys. And that's what we need. And your parents that don't have it together with, with your kids, whether they're supposed to or not, you need to get it together for your kids. Because uh, that's the most important fact of your life is they are your creation. And you need to get it together and make sure that your creation is going to better yourselves and obviously, more importantly, your children. So, anyway, smoke the cigar, finish a drink, listen to some music, and just, uh, I don't know. I'm lost every day. I don't even know what to say anymore, man. I'm just thankful that my oldest son, Brody, finally started banging on the wall. He was really hitting his head into the wall pretty hard. And no matter what you do, uh, that's, that's his sensory needs, his issues where he will do it over and over again. Uh, there's nothing you can do. You could stop him, he'll push off you away, like, don't touch me, I'm gonna do it. That's a life, baby. All right. Good night.